It's like, you tell me I smell good, like, you don't gotta tell me I'm pretty. Just tell me I smell good. Hey, we are going back into another four week lockdown. So what's everybody doing? Scramming to get shit done. A new day. Hi, boo boo. Um, for everybody that's been wondering how she's been doing, she's been good. Um, she hasn't had any symptoms. I did start her on that low protein. Well, she's been on a low protein diet, but I was giving her vegetarian food, which she hated. Like it was soft vegetarian food because the hard version of it, um, it's really hard to find vegetarian food for dogs, by the way. So there's just one brand. I bought the hard food and she did not like it. So I basically, I mean, I should return it because it was like 20 bucks. So I bought the canned food version and she'll eat it when she's, very hungry like but after a while she's just like i'm you know like when you keep eating something and it's not that good you really not you're really not fucking with it sometimes i would switch it up and get her like canned food that is like fish and like sweet potato and she loves that but i do notice with that kind of food um i was just like doing trial and error i feel like her symptoms would come more often so since i started her on what's wrong what's wrong since I started her on the low protein food that I got from the vet, like they actually gave me one to get. It was $50 for the big bag. Um, but she, yo, she loves it, you guys. Like she usually eats three times a day, but with the other food, she would not eat three times a day. This food is like every like three hours, she's crying because she's hungry. So she really likes it. And then I also got the canned version just to try it out in case she didn't like the hard food because I told you guys she didn't like the other hard one. I spent like three something at the vet. But that was also including her shots and stuff and the medicine as well. So basically I had my morning French vanilla. I don't, yeah, I need to go grocery shopping. So um, I've been like stretching out the dates until like I really need to go because I have a bad habit of letting just like too much stuff in my house. Um, and I hate it. It's really, really annoying. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to wait till I really need stuff. I ran out of the cold brew, so I was even like making coffee with like the hot coffee and adding ice. So I went to go make coffee this morning and I had no coffee. I had the Tim Hortons French Vanilla K-Pods. I don't like them. It tastes like shit. So I definitely didn't get any caffeine because it's just sugar. So I'm going to go to Starbucks. I was going to make my avocado toast. I don't have any avocados. We actually need to get groomed. You guys, her nails grow so fast, it's crazy. I'm gonna get me some coffee. I'm gonna get my spinach and feta egg white wrap that I always get. I usually get banana bread as well. I'm gonna get it to snack on it after. And then we're gonna get her some puppuccino. You want puppuccino? You want puppuccino? <laughs> Boo boo. You want puppuccino? Ah! That, don't do that. Boo boo. Okay. You look so scruffy. Okay, I don't want to make out with you. I love you. I don't want to kiss you. I'm wearing the cute denim jacket from the from the Boohoo haul. Um, it's so cute. Like I love it. I also need to put on some perfume. This is what I'm wearing. I'm literally. I told you all where I'm going. I'm not going anywhere serious. But I really love this jacket. It just makes my black and white fits pop. I'm just wearing this sports bra um, that I got. Honestly, I'm kind of feeling to bring out the slides. So I'm going to wear my white Balenciaga um, slides that need to be thrown out. But I don't have any other <laughs> pool slides. So I'm going to wear those. Don't ever get white slides especially if they're designer because they don't last at least mine did not last yeah it's a cute outfit and we got the black writing also i'm just gonna put on this fragrance that i had in my purse um i'm too lazy to go into my beauty room so i'm gonna spray this this is i got this when i got my louis vuitton spring street bag this is matière noir but i got another one I don't know what I did with them. This smells really good though. I have like three other ones, but also I'm really short, so I can't see over my dresser. So it's probably in there somewhere. 
yeah, this is that, that smoky, fiery smell. I didn't put on perfume last night after my shower. So I definitely need this. I still smell good. Don't get it twisted. You know, I'm going to put on a little bit of my Pum Pum Juice or P-U-S-S-Y oil because it's just like a very nice, natural smelling oil. When I tell you guys it smells so good, I always get compliments. Um, homeboy that I told you guys about, literally every time he sees me, he tells me I smell good. So... Listen, that is honestly personally one of my favorite compliments. Like, you tell me I smell good, like, you don't gotta tell me I'm pretty. Just tell me I smell good. And it's like, okay, period. I don't always wear the same fragrances um, when we hang out, but I definitely always do the oil. Um, and then whatever fragrance I feel like wearing. Maybe I'm about you. I better be blood. If it ain't me, your mom, it shouldn't be showing you no love. You cannot run all over the car when I'm driving, Chad. Right, are you looking for the cake? Grande Vanilla Oat Latte for Venti. Do you want to know, it comes with six forms of vanilla for Venti. Do you want to make like half and half, like the three vanilla, three white mocha? Um, yes, please. We got a change of plans today. I'm not filming at my Zara haul. I was going to go to the mall because I wanted to get... Two more pieces from Zara that I was just, I saw on the website. I found some more stuff on Zara. Because watching some Zara hauls. Um, and then I just got into this, like, funk. Um, so now I'm, like, sad. I don't really, I mean, I don't know exactly why. I mean, there is a lot going on in my life right now. But, like, I don't know. I just got into, like, this, like, mood where I didn't feel like filming so, um, I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go shop. And then I'm not even in the mood to shop, so I'm just gonna take pictures. I have to be somewhat productive today, and I do need to post on Instagram, as I was saying earlier. So I got ready, I put together a really cute outfit. I was, I moved my plant over there because I was gonna take it in my room. It doesn't look like how I want it to. I mean, the sun went down now. I didn't like how it looked with the, the sun in my face. But I'm probably just gonna take it underground against this white wall that I found, like, um, in some random room by the elevators. Um, but I'll show you guys my outfit real quick. My battery's about to die. Outfit I put together. I'm just waiting for my phone to charge. I want, you know, get some more juice on my battery. But I look good, so I have to, I have to get a good pick today. Come through legs. How long I'll be able to wear these shoes for? <laughs> um, but I think I should be okay. It's my first time actually wearing them. So yeah, let's just hope I get a really good pick because I look really cute today. My mom's calling me. Hey guys, so it's been what, two days since I've vlogged. Y'all, there's just so much going on and you guys know because obviously I'm pretty sure I've been keeping y'all updated with what's been going on with the lockdown. And so as y'all knew, we were out of lockdown or out of the gray zone or the we can't, we can't keep up okay i don't know how many damn zones there is we're moving gray red green yellow purple fuck i don't fucking know i just know that you know for a while i was going to vaughn because everything in my zone or my area um toronto was still closed we finally opened back up what two three weeks two three weeks ago we finally opened back up and then the government decides what what did I find out two, three days ago? The, gov the government decides, hey, we are going back into another four week lockdown. So what's everybody doing? Scramming to get shit done. So I called yesterday to the place I normally get my pedicures from. They're like, oh, we're fully booked. I would have rather them just tell me, hey, we're, we're fully booked for today. Tomorrow's Good Friday, so we're gonna be closed. And Saturday, we're just, we're, you're done for. Bitch, you're fucked. So they're like, oh, when would you like to book for? I'm like, for today. Oh, we're fully booked. I'm like, okay, what about tomorrow? Um, tomorrow's Easter. We're closed. Okay, what about Saturday? Saturday, the lockdown starts. I'm like, okay, so... Okay, anyway, so I did some research. I found another nail salon in Vaughn, um, BB Spa. I actually just posted on my story that if anybody needs a pedicure, go now. Because they're keeping their doors open until... I think they said they're going to close at like 10. When I called earlier, they said 10. Now the guy that did my toes said 11. Because 
it's just just crazy right now we're all just trying to scram to get things going i probably i'm acting like a crackhead right now because yo this shit is <laughs> it's crazy um and y'all know i need my toes done because i still have to produce content i have to take pictures and my big toe was actually like split like it was cracked and i called yesterday and then my cousin called when i was on the phone with her i was getting ready to come here for what, was, what time was my appointment 5 30 my cousin called because i'm like oh, i'm going you should try calling and she's like it says online they're closing at seven and i'm like no sis call she's like yo you're the goat <laughs> because uh she's going for eight um i literally was working all day i went to my girl's house last night just for like a, she had like a gathering because she just moved and I brought my camera, charged you guys, emptied my memory card and everything and it just didn't end up being one of those ones to vlog. Like I had a lot of fun but it was just in the zone in the moment. I wasn't even thinking about the camera. Um, so I ended up sleeping over because I had a little too much to drink. And as much as I wanted to go home and whatever, like I'm not taking the chance or whatever. I wasn't that drunk but like I just, you know, I'm not gonna, it's not a... Like, you don't take chances, whatever. I've just been working all day. I had another video to hand in. So, I did that. And then I'm about to go back home. Actually, so, if you guys don't know, um, first of all, if you don't, if you've never tried Earl's Kitchen and you have one in your area, I highly recommend the Santa Fe Chicken Salad. It's really, really good. I just ordered it because I'm in Vaughn. It's 10 minutes away. And I have a 10 minute wait time, so. I just decided to finally vlog and put you guys in on what's been going on. I'm about to pick up. I'm so hungry. And I still have to go home and finish editing another video. Um, but I'm going to go live with it tonight. This girl took down my name for my food. And I don't know where she got Jana from. Because I said Dana. And I tried to correct her before hanging up the phone. And she just hung up. Like, Shorty could not wait to get off the phone. Everybody's just on edge today. Like, damn. Like, okay, I get it. But, like. Sis, she gave me okay Jana, see you. Bye. I was like, wait. It's not even my name, sis. Okay, um, I didn't vlog at all today. I'm sorry. I had such a productive work day, which is good. I just ordered some food because I'm hungry. Don't I actually don't have groceries, so I haven't gone grocery shopping. I just ordered a chicken parm from Joey's. Look at the cheese. Look how much cheese they gave me. What am I supposed to do with this? Hello? The disrespect. And it's all kick off painting. Like, okay. But you know what? I'm starving. I'm just editing this the photos I took last night. Um, I ended up getting a photo. Hey you guys, honestly. Well, y'all probably won't be able to tell, but I'm not even gonna act like this is the next day. It's been a couple days. Um I've been so busy with work, y'all not complaining. Of course, I'm super blessed and whatever, but Woo, it's been back to back um, filming and editing. I've had like so much videos to hand in. But anyways, I'm gonna make a quick run to Starbucks because I still haven't gone grocery shopping. I need to go later. I look crazy. I need to go later today um, after I finish my work because I, I need to stop buying food. <laughs> um, but I just opened up a package from Boohoo. Um, and I put on this bodysuit because I just, y'all know me and my loungewear. I ordered like three jumpsuits. And this, you guys, you guys know I usually wear petite sizing. I didn't get petite sizing because um, they didn't have like the strappy jumpsuit. And it, it almost didn't fit. So one, I'm getting thick. But two, I can wear regular sized jumpsuits. I'm getting thick, you guys. I'm here for it. You guys, this fits like a freaking glove. I love it. I was going to put on the chocolate brown one, but I really like the gray. And it's a regular size. This is not petite, and it fits, you guys. Like, I actually had to really pull it up because I guess, you know, I'm getting thicker in, like, my butt and my hips and whatever. My, my, my thighs in general. So I'm going to get some coffee and a sandwich. Um... I was going to go grocery shopping, but I just want to hand in my work, like, early today. Um, so I'm going to do that. Oh, I also have to go to Shoppers Drug Mart. To have my... I just love this bag. It's so freaking cute. And then I'm going to put on... Is it? I need black sandals. Or slides. What shoes are we going to put on? I don't have black sandals. Is it sandal? Let me just figure out what temperature it is before I get fucking carried away. What is it outside right now? 
Oh, it's 14 degrees. It is it's warm enough. All right, so this is what we are gonna wear. <laughs> I got this cute jacket from Misguided. Boohoo um, jumpsuit, as I told you guys. Balenciaga hourglass bag. And then I'm just wearing my Balenciaga slides. Do not ever buy white slides. Do you see this? They didn't even last me like a year. But I got these like three years ago. But don't ever buy white slides. Don't do it. Especially if they're expensive. Don't do it. I should have just got black. Um, but yeah, we outie. Hi there, how are you? Do you guys have all your your sandwiches available right now? I drink and not a smoking, but for me, you hit that pound cake. One hundred and for the next one. Period. You a fucking soldier. I'm, I'm trying to vlog, and my car is just not equipped for my job. <laughs> like, the shit I have to do to get the tripod to just, just to chill. She a hottie, she a betty, she a smoker. I don't, I told you, what? Chai is going at it with the puppuccino. I ended up taking her with me. But um, I'll show you guys what I got from Starbucks. I haven't had this sandwich in a minute. I got the chimichurri chicken sandwich. I remember I had this and it was really good. I'm tired of eating the spinach and feta egg wrap, honestly. Mm, 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 mm. Mm -hmm. um, it has chicken breast, spinach, red peppers, Havarti cheese, and some type of like basil pesto sauce. It's just so good. So good. And then. Shit. So, you got me through the day. I got me. I was gonna get an ice, the brown sugar, whatever. It's so popular right now because it's new that they're just always out of brown sugar. So, I just got, you know, my typical, my fave drink that I put everybody on. Shit, I forgot to tell them to put on the cinnamon powder. It's okay. That's how you know I haven't had it in a while. I got an iced chai latte with oat milk. Y'all know that is my go to. It's really good. If you haven't tried it, you need to try it. Um, light ice. I got two shots of espresso, two pumps of vanilla. I forget if I would add vanilla or what. I gotta go back to, like, the pictures I would post of it. Oh, I have a coffee highlight on my Instagram. But whatever. Let's see how this tastes, though. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let me take a picture real quick. Oh, shit, I ruined it. Hold on. Everything's for the gram, boo. Hey, you guys. I am heading to the grocery store. We're going to do some grocery shopping. Stop! I'm leaving and you cannot come with me. I'm sorry. But you cannot come. I'm going to the grocery store. This dog is crying because I'm leaving. Anyways, I went to the grocery store. I just said that. So I'm gonna take y'all with me because I haven't done a grocery shop with me in a minute. And I have a very big list. Like I'm at that point where it's like, I can't even have a full meal because I'm missing like one of something. Like I can't have, <laughs> I can't have pancakes because I don't have syrup. I can't have a bagel because I don't have cream cheese. Um, I have no fruits, I have no oatmeal. I have no greens. <sighs> I have like dinner stuff, like frozen stuff and rice, but yeah, I like I need stuff. Orange juice. So I'm so tired. So sleepy. I'm gonna put on my Uggs today. <sighs> oh, I need. I did laundry today, and I was about to do another load. I have no detergent. <laughs> I just ran out. Like I used the last of it for my last load and I'm just gonna grab some softener while I'm at it because like it's just you guys we started lockdown today again 
I got like a, it's really bad. Like you go into Dollarama and Walmart, they actually saran wrapped off sections that are considered non-essential. So that's fitness equipment, magazines, greeting cards, gift cards. Y'all, like it's so, I don't know, like it's just a lot. Like everybody in Ontario is very upset. Um, you can't even buy clothes at Walmart. Um, let me actually see if I can find it because I was just looking at somebody's page. It's actually... What the, like the stuff I'm just seeing on the internet right now. I don't remember who... Who's thing. I was looking at... But even so, at Dollarama, school supplies are considered non-essential. But it's like, so you have kids now virtually learning from home, and they need school supplies to do so. So how are school supplies? I'm so, like, I mean, regardless of whether they're doing virtual learning or not, I just don't understand how school supplies are considered non-essential. Non In the dollar store, kitchen supplies. Anything for the home, Tupperware, like, it's considered non-essential. Like, you literally can't buy it. Um, we're fucked, basically. I look crazy, but I was just listening to this voice note I got. <laughs> and I had to turn on my camera because what the hell? Like, yo, niggas are funny. That's all I have to say. Just listen to this. I appreciate that. Thank you for telling me no. Thank you. you okay, first of all, this guy messaged me and was put up some posts on Snapchat about... Um, you know when people have their scamming, their scam snaps or whatever? He took a picture of some money and was like let me log it or i don't remember either way it was something about letting him log in he'll pay me he's gonna reply a scam okay i just said no i just said no i appreciate that thank you for telling me no thank you you was respectful that's all you had to say thank you so much you look good too and i shop at zara and i be on the south side and i be in atl i be everywhere man we should link up but you know how y'all boozy females are you want to see some money? I'm a scamming nigga, though, so I can provide. <laughs> you can pay, I can pay the bills, baby. We can go to Cancun tomorrow. You smell. Tomorrow. <laughs> I'm, some I'm a comedian, too. But look, that boy just said, little boy got your female's head messed up, for real. But look, what's your IG? Drop your IG. Oh, you're going to be a little bougie. You're going to be bougie, too. I got, a, I got a YouTube channel, too. I got some subscribers. I got, like, five, six hundred subscribers. We slick on the same thing. Google AdSense partner. I'm fresh as fuck. I, sh I shop at Zara. I shop at everywhere, man. I've been on this. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just no basic ass nigga, man. I'm having things. You know what I'm saying? So don't try to go bougie, go big on me, Miss Dana Alexi, because I'm having a lot of things too. A good Yeezy collection. I got the original Yeezys from Nike. You know what I'm saying? But I'm finna go check your little YouTube video out. You feel me? But y'all know how y'all bougie females is. That boy Justin. The boy Justin, he just get to y'all female's head. But I'm finna go look, though. Hold up. Knowing damn well you need a man. I see you got them. You on your story talking about something. Yeah, this is why I need a man. 
don't don't sing city girls <laughs> fucking on a rich ass scamming ass nigga then when it really come down to it for a man to really lead you and be a, be a provider to just act booze you don't have to do that Dana Lex you don't have to go big cause whatever amount of money that you want it can be obtained you see what I'm saying but you gotta stop acting like that stop acting boozy and just so you know I'm not one of these materialistic shallow person but I'm really having a lot but side note money does not mean everything but I can pull like you know I could pull a good amount out to say probably like 50 60k and this is at a young age like 23 24 this is where scamming at a young age gets you you see what I'm saying but it's levels and it's really levels to this But you, you know how y'all females are. You know how y'all females are. Y'all so entitled, you know. It's crazy. Oh, what the Just fuck? a little comedy, though, for you, uh, Miss Dana. Hope all I, I said was no. I That's all I said. Text. That is literally text all I said. Too. You know what I'm saying? Drop your IG so I can... I mean, if you want me to follow you, you know how y'all bougie females are. You know if, if, if a flight is not booked, if a nigga not liking your pics, trying to cash up your 10000 off the rip, it's not going to be appealing to you you know how y'all females is what you want you want that bbl in miami we are having the funds to pay for that that's what you got to understand you can't just be brushing everybody off no 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 we really up baby i don't know how much money you got in your account we have the liquid cash though ready we have the liquid cash we can pull that motherfucker out the safe is no oh yeah let me just stop by my bank and grab some cash oh let me just swipe my debit card now we having the loads at a young age not basic, can do anything we want to. We chilling PPP. I know you've been heard hear about that PPP, man. No, I I haven't. We're up. It's okay. What you want? You don't 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 let me hear you singing those city girls on your story now. Don't let me hear you singing them JT lyrics. Come to call you out, baby. But I also have a proper voice, and I can talk like this, too. I know it's appealing to you bougie females, and that's the type of dude that you like. But uh, <laughs> I was just trying to see. Tonight, did you want to have a good night on the evening and uh, attend Houston's with me? You know? That's my proper voice, you know, when I'm around my white friends and bougie people that you like to be around, you know? <laughs> hey, man, I cracked myself up, man. But for real, I see you, though. I see you, Dana. You say, man, I'm finna subscribe to your to your YouTube. You gonna see me in your subscribers. Please re subscribe back. You know how you bougie females are, though. You just gonna let that motherfucker load up. Yeah, go subscribe to me. I'm wifey type. Yeah, you know how y'all get. No comment. Oh, wait, we got one more. We got one more, y'all. Okay, it makes sense now why you were talking to me like that. I just clicked on your YouTube and you have 243K subscribers. Okay, smooth. Let me know. Damn, this girl is up. Okay. <laughs> I see you. Okay. I am fucking crying. What? I don't even know. Anyways, y'all, I just woke up. Well, I didn't just wake up, but I was checking my Instagram. I don't even check my uh, like my Instagram likes like that, like the notifications, ever since they changed the position in, positioning of it. Um, it's just, I don't know, it just doesn't really pop up in my face like that anymore. But, for some reason, when I checked today, I saw that Khloe Kardashian liked my photo. And you know when, like, you see, well, I don't know. But, like, when whenever I see, like, a celebrity like my photo, I'm always like, am I sure? Because you know there's people that, like, have the same name and they'll add a letter or something. I don't know. I was just like, is this really her? And it was really her. I was like, wow. He says, if it was Kim... I would have fainted for Kylie. I still love Kylie though, but yeah. <laughs>
say for instance two of the 50 minute videos um, become 20 minute videos, you have, we already have those two other 20 minutes and then you would just focus on the other two 15 minutes uh, videos that you're shooting. So I don't know if that's confusing for you, but- Yeah, I was gonna ask you if you're like- Yeah, yeah, yeah. so like, basically that's one of the 15. Right. And then right. And vice versa. So I don't want it to be like a hassle or a stress for you um, by the end of the month. Okay, yeah, cool. that actually that works really, yeah. really well. Cool. So yeah, from here again, I'll just go through it and then we'll figure out the whole contracting situation and then um, it should be good. So let me wait for a second. But um, yeah, so basically, again, you, we can have like frequent uh, talks uh, whenever, just so that we can kind of get an idea of exactly what you want. Also, we're gonna do a bit of research, so we're gonna be watching a lot of your videos. Uh, <laughs> no, we did just watch like two videos today. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Um, to kind of just see how the flow, your flow is, good. but yeah, it was great meeting you, and you um, we'll continue from here. Uh, and yeah, okay. it's good to talk. I look forward to working with you guys. Really nice meeting you guys. You too. Yes, yes, yes. One more thing I wanted to add, Kristen, is um, she has a deal that's coming up with. Gotcha, gotcha. Yes, 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 yes. So, um, with that deal, isn't it um, is it a reel you have to do as well? No, it's not a reel. So it's, let me just pull it up right now. It's one YouTube video, Instagram stories, a 15 second testimonial. So she has to do one of those for um, this deal, especially for you guys now that she has someone that she's working with. Yeah. Because this is like the biggest pain for her right now mm -hmm. is trying to get someone to edit her videos because they're just too much work. It's just too it much is. work. Yeah. Yes, I trust you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, and so with the brand deals and stuff like that, those are kind of um, what are flushing in now, and so you need to have those contents pricing. Right. right. Yeah. yeah. Sounds good. Okay, cool. All right. So, again, um, I will stay in touch with Marion, and then we'll go through um, contracting and stuff like that, and then from there, um, then we'll keep in touch when it comes to like transferring hard drives, even like. Okay, that was a very good meet with this lighting looks really really good hey you guys so i'm getting a video editor this has been like long overdue i've been avoiding it because i'm just like i can do it all and yeah no it's becoming a problem my manager was also on the call as well um we've been looking to find a, an editor for me I'm actually really excited and i'm about to feel so relieved because the pressure and just like the way I'm always so overwhelmed because I have so much going on and um, I'm definitely not complaining because I have to say that I am super, super duper blessed. Like Especially the fact that, you know, like we're still in a pandemic, like my life has changed so much within the past. Like since, I don't know, I don't know, but since like the start of the pandemic, like things were really slow at first, of course, because it hit everybody differently or it hit everybody but as time went on like late last year summer last year like things have just been going so good for me obviously i have you guys to thank for that as well but i don't know what it is but like i've just been so blessed um with so many opportunities to the point where it's overwhelming <laughs> it's overwhelming i this is what i've always wanted so yeah but it's 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 overwhelming i have a lot of uh, brand deals coming in just like i don't know but every my manager's calling me right now but it's really hard you guys like so just throwing it out there it's not for everybody like when i say this like i know there's youtubers that are posting three four times a week that are way more getting more brand deals than me and they're able to edit all their videos but for me like editing is it's very time consuming it takes really long and i have been wanting to post on youtube so much more um you guys have been noticing i've been more consistent but i would like to be more consistent like i'm talking <laughs> three videos a week minimum like i've tried i've done it but it's never i can't keep up with it especially because i have so much more things going on and like a apart from youtube like working on my brand figuring out just like life moving and i'm just not somebody that can do it all on my own anymore like it's at a point where there's a few bumps in the road and i just don't want to keep fucking up <laughs> basically i should say um so yeah, basically we we're just like discussing 
um, the rate that we're gonna agree on, the amount of videos, and we're just obviously had to talk about all that stuff. Um, and I don't know, I just feel so relieved. Obviously, we haven't even like started and they haven't sent over the contract, but I already feel so relieved because I'm so overwhelmed. I want to see how it goes. I definitely do. I definitely did want to do more, but I just, you know, trial first. If I really like how this goes. So yeah, but I just, I just feel a lot better. That's also why I haven't been vlogging because I have had so much work to do this week. I filmed a video last night. I stayed up till pretty late. I went to go take my pictures. Underground, they were turning out really trash at first because of the lighting, but I ended up getting a good photo, I think. Um, not too bad. I don't know. I just, I don't know. Yeah, I'm just really excited. Um, we got some good sponsorships coming in. They're just flowing in. And I'm just so blessed and thankful, but it's at a point where I definitely had to do something about it. And so did my manager. Definitely great. She's like, no, we can't. We can't do this anymore. Or you can't. Well, we, because we're a team. Because <laughs> if you know, that shit takes forever. Forever. Um, I'm going to go do my makeup and get ready to film another video that I have to submit later today. And then I have to film another video later today. So I, if you couldn't notice, I took off my acrylics like two days ago. Um, because, well, they were growing out and they're looking very bad. You guys know we're back on lockdown. I got a nail sponsorship. So I'm going to put on some press-ons later and film that. Um, I've never done that before. I personally love watching like nail videos, but I don't really know. I don't know how it's gonna do on my channel, so I'm a little nervous about that, but you know, you never know. It's a first for, there's a first for everything, so I gotta film that later. And I also have to do another, this one's super, I love like just Instagram content because you just take pictures and make Insta, um, Instagram stories. So I'm also doing a sponsorship for the bed sheets I told you guys about a couple of vlogs back. I have to take Instagram stories and a photo. Um, also, I got asked about this. The white robe, it's from there as well. Um, but I'm going to do that tomorrow. The haul is easy. I'll be done in like the next three hours. I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like there's one more. Yeah, any other sponsorships? I haven't gotten the products yet. Period. Okay, so I'm okay. I'm okay, but I need to get on it. So I'm going to talk to you guys later. I don't know if I'm going to vlog later. I'm not really doing anything. But I'll be back when I have some interesting stuff to do with you guys. Oh, wait. I want to show you guys one more thing. So I was going through my PR today. Don't judge me. But <laughs> this is um, recycling. So I was going through PR today um, because I was looking for some new products to do my makeup. And I didn't even know that Fenty Beauty, you guys know they have the new Ease Drop blurring skin tints why is my tripod what's going on this is crazy it keeps falling over what the hell okay we're just gonna do it like this okay yeah so i got the new fenty beauty ease drop skin tint somebody dm me and said that we're about the same shade so i think i'm probably like 16 um, so this is like when I get a tan, so definitely 17 when I get a tan. I mean, I don't know yet, but yeah. So they sent me three shades in the Ease Drop Skin Tints. I got 15, 16, and 17. And then, um, I also got the Hydro Visor. I actually already have this and have been using it. It's pretty good. Um, a lot of you, not a lot, but a couple of you guys actually DM'd me when I first got this, when they dropped it. That it broke you guys out. So I've been kind of iffy about using it. But I started using it and I've been fine. So yeah. I have a lot more stuff to go through. But I'm going to leave that for the weekend. Because I'm tired of like my hallway having hella boxes in it. I need to do another giveaway. And I'm going to be doing a giveaway when I hit 100k on Instagram. Which we are like 5k away i'm going to be giving away like one of my favorite fragrances and a couple other stuff i need to think about obviously some products as well but i don't know i just want to do like a nice 
giveaway. So yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys later. Hey you guys, I just have to come on here real quick because because I tried out the, I couldn't wait. <laughs> I tried out the new Fenty Beauty Ease Drop Blurring Skin Tint, baby. I obviously, um, it's not all I'm wearing, <laughs> but I basically just did my makeup how I normally do it, like cream concealer or cream contour, um, powder bronzer, concealer under the eyes, blush. I never thought I would be the type of person to wear a skin tint because I like my coverage, but I don't even need like super full coverage, especially for like an everyday makeup look. Especially if you're wearing concealer, like my skin looks so good. I look, I feel so like pretty, like, oh my God, it's the less is more for me. And you guys know that's kind of where I've been at with my makeup anyways. This is like perfect. And I did um, shade 16. So I think this is like my perfect shade. I didn't even try the other two. Um, I mean, 17 would definitely be like when it gets warmer and I get a little bit more tan. And 15, I didn't try. Um, I probably should have, but 16 looks good. 15 might work too, but 16 maybe looks good. Anyways, I'm going to go and film these videos. So I'll see you guys later. Say hey, everybody. Mm. Oh, boo boo. Oh, boo boo. Hi, boo boo. Hi, boo boo. Ow, that hurts. Hi, boo boo. Ow, chai. Hi, boo boo. Hi, boo boo. She needs a haircut so bad. Looking like she don't live nowhere. Hi, boo boo. <laughs> Hi, boo boo such a baby this is all she wants to do this is all she wants ignore all the boxes in my house you guys it's, there's a lot going on in here right now um i'm done filming my video uh, i'm about to edit it but i had to take a break to eat so y'all went crazy <laughs> in my dms about the brown stew chicken i made two days ago i didn't record it because i just sometimes honestly what had happened was i uploaded my video it was really late like i made this at like 1 in the 12 or 1 in the morning when i was looking like shit like actually and like i was starving and i just wanted to make my food and eat it so i didn't feel like you know whatever but i guess i should make it again in a couple days to be i did make it in a vlog already that's also why i was like you know what i'm not even gonna record it and also it was kind of dry like there was no side meal nothing but today uh, i literally just um i just got off a of fake let me just hide that i just got off a of facetime and uh i'm watching nisi's video <clears throat> or Nisi's vlog but this is the stew chicken or the brown stew chicken it does not look cute because I just started eating it and I'm like let me show you guys my food and then I just fried some plantain just now it's not ripe enough yet but I just knew this drumstick and rice would not be enough to fill me up like I'm starving so I was just like you know what let me just fry two little pieces you know I don't care <laughs> I'm starving it still tastes good